Hello everyone, welcome back to once again another video. Today we are going to be going over the leaderboard layout that I'm currently using on all my accounts. It's a pretty overpowered layout overall and a lot of um, top players are using it right now. So we're going to go over, it's a three different types of uh, flooring layout. So it's make sure you pay attention to everything I say so you can get everything down correctly. So floor 10, you want this like this. Everything else that is not covered in is going to be fillers, trees, haunted wells, etc. The prevent customers from walking around but first you put the these are all dishwashers you want to leave a nice open gap so you usually just do a three by three all the way around and then just the middle block is open for um things to come through then you got the handy dandy two order stands i'm pretty sure you need a block gap somewhere around here i'm not sure completely but i'm pretty sure you would need one um, and then over on the very last row, you're going to have all your stoves. This is on floor 10, by the way. This is not going on first, and I'm going to show you why afterwards. So this is going to be floor 10. So make sure you have floor 10 going correctly. Now, I just put it on floor 9, but this is supposed to be floor 1. So make sure you put this layout on floor 1. It's the most harder one and one people that mess up a lot. This, also, before we get completely into this, I want you guys to know that this is for free-to-play users. You do not need bigger restaurant for this, so hold on one minute so I can get this all set up. One second. Alright, so what you need is a Christmas tree in the corner, three corrupted tables, you also, before we get into this, you do not need all corrupted. You can use summer, royal, etc. Just corrupted is the number one best set to use. So make sure if you want to get really overpowered, then use this. This money is not from this layout. I transferred over from a few accounts to this account, but that is, uh, you know, I did not completely earn this. This is not possible that quickly. Anyways, you're gonna put all uh, eight seats. I believe this is no six seats on the side, three tables, and then all seats right here. Then you want to put a table right here with another table going that way so you can take a look real quick let me move this for you guys and then you want a nice three block gap remember this is two tables and this is not just a one table right here then you got the chairs this one right over here and then as well with the table over this way and this is pretty much how it's going to look out this is what the front looks like so you can take a screenshot wait a second this chair is pointed inwards, by the way. These are desert bars. That's luxury. And that's another uh, tree over there. Uh, the snowmen are not needed. Those are just fillers I was using for the time being because I did not buy any fillers yet. As I'm just starting on this account, that's why I gave it money and everything to get it high and, uh, you know, attracted to the awesome world. Now, oops. Now that we got the front done with the desert bar bars and everything, you want to work on the two, the one table here, then the one table in the very back. Those are pretty easy to get settled. Put the chairs correct if you like. Go ahead. This chair, this one only has three chairs as the tree takes up one of them. So make sure you guys remember that and not mess it up. And then you're going to have two tables like this with only one block gap. I know it kind of got me a little bit thinking as well. But then you got the soda machine right there. It's a soda machine, not coffee machine, just so you know. And then you got the handy dandy more tables in the back you can take a screenshot right here hopefully you guys can get this down as well as this layout is a little bit hard and difficult to um get going because it is uh like a little bit hard it did take me like 30 minutes to get it completely correct so they have little mess ups so then we had the three tables on this side with chairs all around and that should finish it off for the layout make sure you have the chairs over there and the uh tree over there the two trees and then you have a tree over there, so it's connecting all the tables, doing times two money, which is really overpowered for the layout. Now we're gonna be moving on two through nine. So you want floors two through nine to look like this, which is gonna be on my eighth floor. So this floor is gonna be through two through nine. So make sure you guys remember that two through nine, so everyone has that correct. Remember the first thing I've showed was floor ten. The last thing I just showed was um, floor one. Now this is gonna be going through two through nine. So make sure you guys pay attention. Alrighty, so now you have the handy dandy, another corrupted, and then a tree in the middle with two more corrupted over there with two more soda machines. So make sure you can take a screenshot real quick or pause the video and get everything going like that. Give you guys a few seconds to get that settled. Now, you want a two block gap right behind the tree, one block behind the tree, and then one block this way. Why? Because it's going to help the customers 
and staff go anywhere onto the tables without any time moving and causing more delay into it. Now, you want the two ta tables on this end and then two ta one table there because the desert bars are going to completely complete that over. Now, you have this as well right here. Uh, after the two block gaps, make sure you guys can take a nice old pause in the video and get this going as well. I'll give you a moment, no worries. I also want to state that the desert bars do give you a lot more money and tips and everything, so it will add up and get you a few million overnight, maybe even a bill. Probably not a bill, but a few million overnight to help you boost your money up, and it, that adds up if you continuously over over uh, night a lot. Then you earn a few more billion after probably like a month or so, you know. You never know. Now, you want to head over this way. Okay, if my character just lets me. Now, you have four coffee machines because those, of course, uh, speed up the a whole process, of course. Then you got this for speeding up eating. So that's what the luxury is for, and that's what uh, this is for, for customers to walk fast, and then that's for them eating. Now, the desert bar just for tips. So you can have four of them like this. This is, the, I believe, the best way to get tips. I'm not 100% sure on this because I do buy dessert which is really overpowered for the restaurant to earn more and more money. Now you have two up there and then, you know, one up there and then uh, four right here. And that pretty much is two through nine. And that's pretty much how it ends off. Now, if you guys want screenshots of the layout and a complete example, jo join my Discord, discord.gg slash greendevilplays, and DM me for the uh, LB or leaderboard layout pictures i do have them um downloaded on my phone so i can feel free to send that to you guys anytime you like so feel free to message me over there anyways guys if you like today's video and look forward to more videos coming very very soon and more daily uploads if i have been gone for a couple days but i will be doing daily uploads from here on out so make sure you guys like and subscribe and i'm gonna see you guys back on the next one